I'm gonna start by putting my beads in a mixing container. Hey there, it's Katie here. I just wanna hop on today to show you guys how to make one of my fave projects, aroma beads. They soak up fragrance oil and can be used all over the place once they're dry. Let's do it. I'm gonna start by putting my beads into my mixing container. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that your mixing container is tightly sealable because we're gonna be shaking it up in just a minute. Just pour it on in. Okay, now we can put that off to the side for now. All right guys, I got my fragrance here ready to go. Today I'll be using Fresh Rain. Take this and pour it into another mixing beaker because I'll be adding colorant into it later. Oh my gosh, you guys, seriously, so fresh. Okay, now that this is poured into a separate container, I'm gonna grab my colorant and add some fun color. I'm just gonna add in just a couple drops. Cool. Now that that is dropped in, I'm gonna grab my stirring utensil and give it a good stir. Pretty mixed up, and I'm going to add that into my beads that we just set aside. I'm just gonna drizzle that all over the top. Okay, now that the colorant and fragrance mixture is in, I'm gonna close this container, make sure it is super secure, and give it a good shake. Look at that color disperse, that is perfect. Okay, there we go. When all the beads are thoroughly coated with the fragrance and dye mixture, they need to be given time to absorb and dry. Depending on your fragrance type, this could take anywhere from 24 hours to a couple of days. Thicker fragrances such as vanilla, vetiver, or Egyptian musk will take much longer than those on the thinner side. Regardless of your fragrance you're using, shake the beads every now and then to check to see if they're dry. Well, now I gotta let my beads soak, so I'm gonna head out and check in with y'all soon. And, I'm back. Now that the aroma beads have soaked up all the fragrance oil, I'm gonna test it and see how we did. That is scented perfectly. If you want your beads to smell stronger, repeat the previous steps and wait some more. Just make sure you're only adding half an ounce of fragrance at a time or your beads will never dry and we don't want that. When you're happy with the strength of the beads like I am, all it's up to do is package them. Keep them in an airtight container like this one if you want to keep them smelling strong before you ship them out. Aroma beads can be used in muslin or sachet bags. It can be placed just about anywhere, including your cars, musty closets, and even your drawers. It costs us about $2 to scent 4 ounces of beads. These air freshers can be sold wholesale for around three to four dollars and retail for around six to eight, depending on the packaging and level of customization. Let us know what you want us to make next in the comments down below. Also, ring the bell to be notified when we post. See you all again soon. Bye.